In this video, we're going to turn this empty barrel into a incinerator bin. This is very easy to do. We simply need to cut off the top, and then put some holes in around the bottom that will allow it to breathe. You can actually get drums like this pretty easily, especially if they are damaged like this one. This one actually has a big dint in the side where it actually fell off a wagon. So the firm that was using this did not accept it, so therefore it was essentially a piece of scrap. To cut the top off, we're going to use this ur chisel. These are very good on jobs like this, and I actually cut one of these off a few days ago and it took me about two minutes. So that's the actual chisel, and that is the ur gun. This will be connected to the ur supply and the compressor. It's a good idea getting the drum somewhere where it can't move, and in this particular instance, I've actually got it on a rubber mat, and also it is jammed up against the bench. A couple of days ago I actually used a ratchet strap and I ratchet strapped this to a, an RSJ in a factory and that enabled me to cut the lid off very easily. It's going to be very noisy when we do this so it is essential that you take precautions and put on some ear defenders and also some safety glasses. I'd just like to point out that this is actually a clean drum, it's never been used. You do not want to get one that has had flammables in it or any dangerous chemicals. We now need to put some holes around the base. To do that, you can use a step drill like that, which is the easiest option, or you can use hole saws. I've now got about eight holes in the bottom of that drum. That should allow it to breathe quite easily when there's a fire in there. So all we need to do now is take this outside and replace the old bin. So as you can see, we've really had our money's worth out of the old bin, and that is quite literally in pieces. And luckily the lid fits from the last incinerator bin. Quite a for watching this video. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel.